And if I could ask Denise Toria and Walter McKeever to please join me on the stage. Take the stairs. <laughs> All right. I have the honor of presenting the annual Cure JM Champion Award, which is given to a person or family that's made a significant difference for Cure JM and the children battling this disease. This year, it is personal, just like having JM in our lives is personal. The Cure JM Champion Award goes to a few deserving members of my family. Denise Doria, my sister-in-law, and Walter J. McKeever, or otherwise known as Grandpa Wally. Can you please give them a round of applause? off a surprise award like this when your sister-in-law is on the board and coordinating all these different things is no easy feat. Okay? But I'd like to give you a little bit of background of why they're deserving of this award. It all started in 2006. Remember that one picture where we were at the Chicago Marathon and you saw my daughter Megan who was this, this big and my son that was this big but you know it all started 11 years ago. And it was Cure JM's first conference in Chicago Marathon. I organized it and decided to also run it. And so, you know, when running, doing and running and organizing this event and having a, a child that was four year old and six, that I asked Aunt Denise to fly to Chicago to help to help us because I knew for sure I was going to need Kevin to run errands. I need someone to look after my kids. So, you know, I knew I'd need the extra help. Well. One thing led to another, and the whole event kind of snowballed and got really like you know crazy busy in that. And while we were at it, we decided to set a lofty fundraising goal. And it's like, pick a nice round number. How about a quarter of a million dollars? You know, if we're going to run 26 miles, we want to raise some serious money. And so, I just kind of threw it out there and said, Hey, I'm running the marathon. Come run with me, and you know, other people come and let's raise a quarter of a million dollars. And so, and raise greater awareness. So we had this Chicago Marathon team. And uh, so not only did Aunt Denise take time off from work and fly to Chicago with us, they started talking, Denise and Grandpa Wally, and they decided to send out a very personal letter to approximately 400 of their clients. You see, Walter J. McKeever and Associates is really Walter J. McKeever and his daughter, Denise Doria, that are the two partners of this family, very successful family accounting business in um, Greenwich, Connecticut. The letter they sent out through their clients was a personal story about Megan being challenged with JM and what we were going to do to make a difference. The support of their clients has been and continues to be exceptionally generous, with raising on average 30000 every time we run one of these events. This is truly a testament of the great service and the incredible dedication and caring for their clients and coming full circle back to Cure JM. So, since our very first annual conference in 2006, and through this conference today, I've kind of added it all up. They've sent out over 3,000 letters to their clients. Many of them, if we don't have a conference in a given calendar year, are actually reaching out and saying, when are you sending me my letter? Um, but they've sent out over 3,000 3, letters during these 11 years, and collectively they've raised more than $300,000 for Cure JM. In those early days, starting in 2006, and Aunt Denise would come and take care of my, our kids, while Kevin was the gopher doing anything I asked, um, she would not only look after my kids, then she also looked after the kids' room. So you can relate. So we had this kids' room, and we're no longer allowed into any children's hospital with, with those, um, what are those called? The, 
the glitter, no glitter, there's no glitter, but uh, we've been, um, you know, but anyway, and she not only looked after my kids, but she got to be known to so many other families as, as Aunt Denise because she was looking after everybody else's kids at this event. But as time went on and as we grew, you know, beginning in 2008, she kind of got roped in more and more, and she also took on the Cure JM CFO role, which is great because she's a certified CPA. She served and continues to serve on a number of other boards in addition to Cure JM, both for profit and nonprofit, and really has helped ensure that we are running this Cure JM organization to some of the highest standards from both a fiduciary responsibility standpoint as well as from a donor perspective. And now, coincidentally, this is Grandpa Wally's first conference. It's not that he hasn't wanted to come, just family circumstances prevented it until now. So Grandpa Wally has always been very supportive with the fundraising letters, his personal donations, is really, and it's been really terrific to have him at these events in Austin. So Denise, Grandpa Wally, I love you dearly. And on behalf of Cure JM, it is my pleasure to recognize you as the Champion Award for this year and for making a difference in the lives of our family in the lives of many of the children here, even though they haven't met you, and really helping ensure we have the funds to help research, to fund, to advance the research that's done. So I want to congratulate you for being recognized.